actually I finished university, I applied for EF, I was very keen, they said no. And therefore the next bit was I didn't know what I wanted to do, so I wanted to solve a lot of problems. So I applied to a few consultancies uh, and uh, I ended up at Bain. Um, really like that, fun people, smart, interactive, very data driven, very... Um, um, it, it taught me how to work fast with big old companies, right? What What is the right balance of innovation, best decisions, bringing forward better solutions with people that don't move fast, right? Like we did one of the biggest mergers in the brewing industry. We worked with financial institutions, insurers, all these kind of guys. And also I was... But then at Bain, it was interesting. We were working in teams of five people, 10 people for very intense projects for a couple of months. I think that, but still be friendly. Bain has this very keen mantra of a Bainy never lets another Bainy fail. So if someone at your in your team is not performing, it's everyone's fault, it's not their fault. You don't step over people to get promoted faster, stuff like this. And I think a lot of that uh, I really enjoyed, but there were also parts of you know, you find an interesting problem and you spend nights making it better, finding a better solution, but then you realize maybe that company doesn't have the capabilities to implement it quickly or to do it the way you want it. So they dumb it down. It takes twice as time, a long time to do it. And that sometimes is frustrating. Plus like the idea that, okay, I work for three months on something and then I have to move to something else. And I, I kind of like advising, but I like solving problems and seeing the benefits of removing that problem myself. So I think that's why I wanted to leave.